Hi there. One of the features that I added in version 5.6.3, the link that I shared yesterday, is in your post process tools, curve range. So curve range is basically to reduce your dirt marks on the carpets or on walls or whatever. You can use it on dark areas or you can use it on light areas. So because this is a dark area, let's just let me just show you. Uh, so firstly, you're going to select the area that you're working on. Press OK. And now because this is a dark area, I'm going to double click on the shadows eyedropper tool. If this was a white mark, then I'd be using the highlights. So double click on the shadows. Then first you're going to sample the uh, an area on the carpet that does not have the dirt spot because you want to sample that color and place it on the dirt spot to match it. So press OK and now you can you can see on your eyedropper tool you basically sample the color so it has like ink inside of it and then just place it onto the dirt spot like that and then press OK. You can just say no to this. And then just resize your brush a bit. And then my flow is on 10% and opacity on 100%. So now I'm just going to basically dodge it. It doesn't have to be perfect because you can make adjustments to this afterwards as well. So just keep brushing it away. And now I want to match this a bit more. So I'm going to double click on my curves and then I'm going to adjust it a bit. If you're not comfortable with using curves, after you've brushed it in, you can use Ctrl or Command L to bring up your levels, or you can uh, use uh, Ctrl or Command U to bring up your UN saturation, and you can then just use this instead. So, yeah. I hope this helps.